Welcome to Friday Info. Here we talk about apps, uh, interviews. We do interviews with uh, entertainers, uh, filmmakers, uh, people that have to do with uh, the entertainment world. Um, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe when you have a chance. Today we're going to review Movie Look. Uh, it's a pretty cool app. As you can see, there's like a whole bunch of different options for movie look as far as what you can, you have options to use. Um, currently right now, you definitely got like, a, got the blockbuster look, you got the grind, the gringe look, you got quite a bit of different looks that, you know, if you like, you can, you know, pick each one. If, um, if you looked at my trailer, uh, The Renters, I actually used the movie look to uh, pick one of them to have a, a blockbuster look. And uh, that's pretty, pretty neat to use uh, as far as the movie look that you can record and stuff like that. Um, if you're looking for a grind look, if you're looking for a uh, black and white view, if you're looking for you know, a certain view, you can you pick that off the, the default setting. Well, I mean, the settings that you have there at the, um, what, what's on display. And then uh, you basically process that, check it out, and see if you like it. Or you can cut and edit where you can cut what you know snippet you can I mean it's limited to what how much you can do as far as cutting and editing because all it does is just basically cuts the video shorter but um it definitely helps with in between cuts and stuff like that or a screw up and you got a part where you know I only want this line or that line and it, it definitely helps with that um, it's easy to download, it's easy to upload to different uh, um, apps. Uh, as far as if you want to upload it to your email, if you want to save it to your, your cell phone, if you want to share it, uh, the movie look and stuff like that, that's pretty cool stuff. When I was using it for the trailer, um, the renters, um, basically, uh, after I did the footage, I went through movie look make sure you have plenty of light because you know it, it thins the filter and it makes it a little bit darker so make sure you have plenty of light when I did the renders majority of those scenes were outside um, or had plenty of, of light so make sure you have plenty of light when you're doing the you know, footage you know it, it's good to do a few tests as far as downloading um, the footage and then going through the filter to see how it initially looks if you're looking for a certain look. And remember what you picked. I remember when I was going through my editing, I forgot halfway through what what kind of look I was doing. I had to go back and keep on checking what look I, I was off. Uh, but yeah, make sure you, uh, you write down the initial look that you have so you can continue that look throughout the whole, the whole um, the editing process. Um, I advise if you do do it, make sure you just basically go through all your footage and pick out the ones that you want and go through all the filters, the filter that you want, and then d download after the fact, after you have edited, cut, and then you all you have to do is just filter through the whole thing. So that's my review for Movie Look. Uh, it's made by. Uh, Red Giant. So, whenever you have a chance, to download it, check it out, and have a, you know, have an awesome time with it. All right, guys. Guys, take care. Deuces. Please hang up and try again.